presents the Insurance Countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Transmission. Welcome back to the Irwin Tools Endurance Countdown. I'm Grant Rowley, I've got Jack Perkins and Chris Jewell with me. And today we're talking about the Techno Auto Sports Falcon of Jonathan Webb and Richard Lyons, of course competing in the Mother Energy Drink sponsored Falcon. Now Chris, Jonathan Webb ended the 2010 season with a win. He started this year with a sixth place over in Abu Dhabi, but since then results have been hard to come by. Where's the speed going? Yeah, it's hard to know, isn't it really, Grant? The only thing I can pinpoint is, remember that very big incident they had at Hamilton entering the pit lane? The car suffered significant damage in that wet race. They have not been close to the pace since then. Now, I'm not making excuses to say the car's out of shape, but for whatever reason, it's been a much tougher year than last year. Race winner, as you said, and they started the year well this year, but I just think that probably distracted them a little bit. Loss of confidence, a little bit of form loss, and yeah, they'll be looking for a big improvement in the long distance races because they're a long way down the order by comparison to 2010. Teaming up with John O'Webb is Richard Lyons. He only has a very limited experience in V8 supercars. How do you think he'll go? Yeah, I think he'll do a great job. He's a professional driver. He's definitely someone that I would pick to do the Enduros with because he did a great job in 2006 and 2007 with Triple Eight. The cars are probably a little bit easier to drive now with a sequential gearbox. The big question mark is he's only done the Enduro session at Darwin which was about 15, 20 minutes of driving and he hasn't done any other driving. So hopefully he gets his eye on at Phillip Island and by the time they get to Bathurst, he's up to speed. As Jack says, Chris, that's gonna play a factor. He's only done the Hidden Valley testing. How do you see that? Yeah, look, I think he's um, going to face a stern challenge there, but another pedigree driver with an enormous kit bag of experience. Uh, I think he'll certainly fit the bill there that he's required to fit. That is, you know, be the nominated co-driver, keep it clean, keep it reasonably fast. The key will be staying on the lead lap of this race, that where they may become vulnerable, because if the car's not particularly quick, it'd be even more difficult for Richard to keep the car on the lead lap. The Mother Energy Drinks team has a new team manager heading to his first Phillip Island and Bathurst endurance races. His name's Bruce Jenkins, and Speed Cafe caught up with him. Bruce, uh, you've been with the team now for a little while doing uh, 200 kilometre races, but a 500k and a 1000 kilometre race are going to be certainly different. Uh, what's your feelings heading into the Enduros? Yeah, for sure. It's going to be another steep learning curve for me, going from what is a sprint race into the Enduros. Um, obviously having a, the support of Jeff behind me, the engineer, is going to be of great help. Um, and Jonathan's done it before, and we're very much looking forward to having Richard Lyons on board as well. That was Bruce Jenkins talking about his debut at Bathurst as a team manager. You're on the Irwin Tools Endurance Countdown, and we'll have more with you tomorrow. When you've got a job to do and not much time to do it, you can't beat Irwin Groove Lock Pliers. With an innovative press and slide button, they adjust twice as fast as a regular pair of multi-grips. Irwin Tools.